back with another weapons mini weapon creations um this is called the toothpick blowgun and it is able to hold up to eight darts so i will come back to you with the materials your first three items you're going to need three pens um the bottoms have to be able to come off and you just need the casing uh okay i'll come back to you with the next one next you'll need two paper clips of any size a toothpaste toothpaste lid and a large or significantly um, big bottle cap. Um, I found this off of a energy drink. And last, you are going to need duct tape. The ammo materials you are going to need are four Q-tips. And last, you are going to need eight um, toothpicks. Now the tools that you'll need to build this is a hobby knife or a razor blade, either one works, and or a pocket knife. Then you require a needle nose pliers, or you can use your hands, but needle nose pliers is better. And finally you will need super glue or hot glue, either one works. Okay, your first step is you're going to take apart your pens, including the bottom. You're just going to need the inner shell or the casing, okay? Okay, once you have your three shells, they should look like this. And now what you're going to do is you're going to take one end of each pen, and you're going to tape it to the other end, such like that. And you're going to do the other with the other pen on the last side, too, like that, okay? I will show you what that looks like in a minute. Okay, once your pens look like this, and you've taped each side with duct tape so that they're connected, you're going to um, take your paper clips, and you are just going to straighten them out with the needle nose uh, pliers or your hands, okay? Make sure they're as straight as possible, though. Okay, now that once you have, now that you feel that your paper clips are as flattened as possible and you like the way they feel, you are going to take each or one of each and you are going to lay it on the side right here for structural support and then you're just going to tape it on around again, okay? Same on the other side, straight down, and then you're just going to tape it around the, um, the shell, okay? I'll show you what that looks like. Okay, once you've duct taped the, um, supporting paper clips to the rod, it makes sure that it's stable and it will not fall apart. And we will get on to the next step, which is duct taping or gluing the cap onto the pen. Okay, you're going to want to take your large or big cap, and you're going to want to make a circle the size of the pen shell to fit through, right in the middle, okay? I'll show you what that looks like in a second. Okay, once you have the hole cut into the lid, like this, and the pen is able to fit in, like this, you're going to put it down as far as you want, but don't put it too far, close to the top until it slides in and then you're going to put glue in here and down here to keep it sturdy now this um, step is optional you just make sure that the lid is on snug and then it can't fall off easily and after you do that I will get to the next step okay next you're going to want to take your toothpaste lid and you're going to cut the top off right here inside so that this can fit inside Okay, once you have made a big enough hole to fit it onto your, um, your tube, you are going to shove it down far enough for a, the lid to come on with a bit of space, like an inch of space between these two. Next, you're going to take your lid, and you're going to make eight holes around this. Um, try to make them equal spaced, and try to make them a little far away from the center hole. Okay, once you have made eight holes in the top, make sure that a toothpick can fit through each one of them. Now, you are going to attach this on top of this pen facing the open side down, facing the toothpaste lid. And make sure there is at least an inch of space between these two. Okay, now that you have this attached with the um, cap on and it's glued on or it's snug, you are going to... You are finished with your um, blow dart tube, your barrel. Now you're going to 
uh, make the ammo. Okay, for the ammo, you are going to take one Q-tip and break it in half. Once you have half a Q-tip, you're going to take this end, or the sharpest end of the Q-tip, and you're just going to lightly stab it into the end of the Q-tip, or the toothpick into the Q-tip. Okay, once you have made your ammo, and split the Q-tip in half, you're just going to tape the Q-tip to the um, toothpick. And then these small eight holes are for the uh, Q-tips to go into. So you're just going to slide them in, and then the bottoms go into the toothpaste hole. I will come back to you on how to shoot it. Okay. Now how to shoot it is you're going to take one of the Q-tips out of the slot, and you're just going to shove it in the top. Get all the cotton in. And then you're just going to come down. You might have to adjust it a few times. And you're simply just going to blow on it. To shoot the um, blow dart out. Thank you for watching. This is the Q-tip blow dart gun. Um, if you like this, please leave a like. Um, there are links to other videos in the end. Please subscribe and leave a comment for a specialized item that you would like me to make.